Hi everyone, this is Who Gets the Glory, and today we're reading Devotions for a Deeper Life for January 8th. To the end, he may establish your hearts unblameable in holiness before God, even our Father, at the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ with all his saints. 1 Thessalonians 3.13 A true saint has received Christ Jesus our Lord. A saint's conduct does not spring from adherence to external rules, but is the spontaneous outcome of an inward life of holiness and love. A true saint is free from condemnation, Romans 8.1, fully forgiven of sins, 1 Corinthians 6.11, Ephesians 1.7, justified by God, Romans 3.24, sanctified holy, Hebrews 13.12, 1 Thessalonians 5.23, 1 Corinthians 1.30, a child of God, John 1.12, 1 John 4, 1-3, and the possessor of all things, 1 Corinthians 3, 21-23. Saintliness is not a divine anticipation. It can be a fact now. Oh, for more holy boldness to claim what is ours through the atonement of Jesus Christ our Lord. Thou knowest he died not for himself, nor for himself arose. Millions of souls were in his heart, and thee for one he chose. Upon the palms of his purest hands engraven was thy name. He for thy cleansed had prepared his water and his flame. Make sure thou with him art risen, and now with him thou must go forth. And he will lend thy sick soul health, thy strivings, might, and worth. Prayer Thought I am not worthy to be called a saint, Lord, but help me to be one in all my attitudes and actions. Suggested reading, 1 Thessalonians 3, 7-13. Thank you for listening, and God bless you.